We went to the moon for a particular reason. Does anybody know why? Yes? We can go to see what the moon is made of. We can go uh, to do science. Uh, we uh, announced, the president did, President Kennedy 50 years ago, last May 25th, three days after I was born, to go to beat the Russians. After 60 seconds, um, we'll, our rocket will be triggered, and this guy will launch out roughly 1,000 feet above the air, so I'll be able to see it. Inside is an electronic suite containing, um, or you know, measuring the altitude as well as the temperature. So once we recover data from this, we'll compare it to the onboard electronics measuring the same parameter seconds after launch. We're going to be actually at the highest velocity of our, of our um, flight, at just under 400 miles an hour, and right at about 7,500 feet above ground. Um, any higher will be at International Space Station with Leo. <laughs> <laughs> so our first main bulkhead consists of two still cameras that will be taking pictures while it's um, falling, and we have a video camera that will record down the middle of the payload tube during the whole, the whole time. Um, and then we have a thermal sensor and an accelerometer. Here attached, we have a GPS. Uh, we have a camera, a video camera with flash memory on this side that you'll be able to see a little easier in a little bit. Um, a thermal sensor that will uh, record relative uh, humidity, also temperature, and a location beacon so that we can find it after it's landed. You, you know, maybe you know what a treat this is to have Lori here, uh, Lori Garber. So she's going to take uh, your questions, and if you don't ask good ones, she's going to ask you questions. Uh, the first President Bush, I think, said in 89 we were going to go to the moon 10 or 15 years later, maybe made the paper for a couple days. Uh, second President Bush said it, said it, said we were going to go to the moon in 15 years and go on. Um, and then President Obama said we are going to go on an asteroid in 15 years. These are not the times we live in. Uh, not only don't we really know what we're going to do you know, next year, certainly not 10 or 15 years. And so what we are trying to do at NASA is develop capability so that when we have that, hope it's not a cold war, hope it's a, com uh, a cooperative program, hope we say we're going to go with some adversary we have now uh, to Mars, and do this on behalf of planet Earth, uh, that we will have the capability that it will not take 5% of the federal budget, which is what Apollo took. We're not going to have that now. 